Ahmed says, what should I do if someone confronts me about a sin I've done? Should I lie about it and say I didn't do it? What if they think, uh, what if they ask me to swear by Allah that I didn't do it? In this case, not swearing would obviously be like telling that person I've committed the sin. So what should I do in these cases? First of all, it is totally prohibited in Islam to lie. And it's also totally prohibited to expose your previous and past sins. So what to do if someone is an imbecile coming and asking me a direct question? Sheikh, have you ever tried uh, uh, whiskey? Now, I could simply say no. And I did never, alhamdulillah. So I could say no. I said, did you do this? I said, no. And he keeps on asking, this never ends. And this is not appropriate. It's like going to a girl who's a virgin, who's young, and you say, have you ever committed zina? Have you ever tried the secret habit? A'udhu billah. What kind of an, an, an imbecile would ask such immoral questions? So the right approach, the right thing to do would be to express your anger and show that person asking you before he even escalates it to asking you to swear. Because if I say, no, I've never tried to say, say, Wallah, what is this? Is this an interrogation? So the moment he asks you such an inappropriate and immoral question, you have to express your rage and anger and show him truly that you are insulted what kind of question is this? Are you crazy asking me about this question? He said, no, no, I just wanted to know. You, don't, you have no right in asking such questions. I'm not uh, someone from the street for you to interrogate. I'm not working for you. This is insultive. I come from an honorable family. I'm a person who's committed to this. How dare you ask me such a question? And if you do this, even if he's your spouse or she's your spouse, even if, if it's a relative of your kinship, you should stop talking to them for a day, two, maybe three, until the Islamic period is over, which allows you to boycott another Muslim. You can boycott them totally, not answer, showing them that you are insulted and humiliated by such a question. And this is the best way out, inshallah. If they are not satisfied by that, the heck with them. Who cares? Don't even pay attention to them. Don't even respond to them. Don't even talk to them. Such people are not worth wasting time with.